It's not a regular burrito wrapped with tortilla. It's a sushi burrito wrapped with seaweed, and it's located in San Francisco, California. What's up, travel heads? It's Brian for Life of Beauty, and we are here at Sushi Rito in San Francisco. And you're wondering what this place is? It's a sushi burrito. Yeah, you heard that right. The first ever sushi burrito restaurant. It's like a burrito. It's wrapped, but not with a tortilla. It's wrapped with rice and seaweed with the stuffing inside, like the crab meat to fill it up and whatever other type of sashimi or meat you choose. I don't eat raw, so I have a few friends here joining me to eat the raw one while I eat the cooked one. So let's get it. Sushi Rito is a popular sushi burrito restaurant with only six of them all located in the Bay Area. They serve sushi burritos and sushi bowls. We're here at the main location in downtown San Francisco. Can I get the sumo crunch? Yeah, and that'll be all for me. Um, for me that's it. Sumo crunch because I don't eat raw. Sumo crunch is a non-raw sushi burrito stuffed with shrimp tempura and surimi crab as its base. It also includes cucumbers and sriracha aioli topped it with red tempura flakes. So I have here the sumo crunch. I ordered this as a tempura with a lot of crab meat, avocado, cucumber, and the red thing isn't hot Cheeto. It's um, it's actually tempura, red tempura, little shred. And yeah, I ordered this because I don't eat raw, especially raw sushi. So I got this. It's a cooked roll, and we're gonna try it out right now. I'm gonna take a bite out of that tempura, the rice, the crab meat. Take a whole bite out of the whole thing. Instantly, you could um, taste the crab meat in it. As you're crunching, you can start tasting the tempura too, crispy too. And yeah. So, so we, we got, got the, the satori. satori. It's ja Japanese mochi with basically wasabi mayo. Uh, I had this before. It's really good. So, looking forward to it. About to take my first bite. And looks like there's some pickled onions and corn. The fish is really fresh. I have the ginger. The ginger in here. Ginger is really strong, but just enough. I don't know, but it's as good as I remember it. A lot of textures in here. On our next video, we're going to try trending Korean street cheese corn dog from Ixmart. So consider subscribing and give us a thumbs up. Until then, travel heads.